Hey, I'm James from J Technology, and we are back here at CES 2019 at the Las Vegas Convention Center. And we're back here at the Hisense booth, and we have Rick DePiro. I'm sure you remember him from last year, the year before, and, and so on. <laughs> and he's going to go over the brand new triple laser trichroma projection 4K TV. Wow, you did that pretty well. Good that, was that pretty it, close? You got it. It's uh, the, the trichroma laser is our newest technology. By the way, it's good to see you, my friend. Yeah, um, you welcome to CES 2019. Um, th th you, we've always been proud of what we've been coming out with, but this one has become really, you, you know we've talked about lasers since we started a few years oh, ago. Oh, yeah, yeah. This one is like, oh my God. We have three lasers this time. And, you know, when we talk about ultimate viewing, we either talk about, uh, probably people think of a movie theater where it's dark and the contrast is great and the viewing is great and there's no ambient light. So you're watching this really bright screen that's not coming at you, so it's not hurting your eyes, and yet it's huge. But if somebody opens a door on the side of the theater in the middle of the day, it washes everything out and ruins it. So that's kind of the man cave idea where you got to keep the drapes closed. And But the viewing experience is the best because it doesn't hurt your eyes. There's no irritant. When you look at what you have in your home, and it's in a regular room, like a family room or a great room, and it's a new LED, whether it's QLED, OLED, ULED, EIO, LED, there's all these great variations and tremendous technology. We have so many of the beautiful TVs there. The problem is during the day when you have a lot of ambient light and you open the drapes, beautiful. The sunshine comes in, the TV's bright and you can see it. But at night when you turn all the lights off and you want to watch a movie, the idea that laser is not emitting but LED is is just in its own name light emitting right so the emission of light means it's coming at your face and what's not natural is that our eyes receive that much light as we get more and more contrast and brighter and brighter and more resolute our eyes don't change our eyes have never changed I mean they get worse as we get older but they don't get better so the bigger the TVs get the more painful that amount of light coming in gets and the other problem is at night uh, a really strong LED signal lights up your room like a Christmas tree. So you can play cards in the corner. And everyone knows this. It's like looking at your phone at 3 in the morning when you just woke up and you have to see that email for whatever reason. Um, it's too bright and it hurts. you got to dim it. Well, this has none of those problems. If you could have both of those worlds together with no disadvantage, you would take, in this case anyway, three lasers. Not two, but three. Red, green, and blue. So you have pure 100% laser technology cooled in using our T the TI DLP4 chip, working together so that there's um, no hesitancy, there's, there's no refresh rate because it's lasers. So you have this instantaneous, no hiccuping, no latency, beautiful TV experience with rich deep colors and as a lot of people out there would know, when you combine a red, blue and green laser you get pure white for the first time. As far as the black, someone said this morning, well, how do you get it to be black? It's like we just turn it off <laughs> so there's no light. There's no burn, there's nothing coming at your face, so there's no reason why you would have to strain. So you can stare at this tremendous TV. Did I mention the model number yet? The, uh, L1, the 100 uh, L7T? Yeah, I'm not sure. When someone's looking it up online, they'll need to know that. Just look up Trichroma Laser okay. TV. And, um, this is 100 inches. You could stand two and a half feet away and it'll never hurt your eyes. You could watch it for 12 hours. It would never hurt your eyes. You could have the drapes open or all this ambient light like in here, or you could have it pitch black and it will never hurt your eyes. And yet you have the same uh, 35, well, we were averaging as a, as a typical rating, somewhere between 32 and 3,500 lumens. That's brighter than a movie screen. We're at Rec 2020, and you'll see it even in our uh, sign over here. It's Rec 2020 plus HDR extension, so it's actually Rec 2100, which is fascinating. That's the first time ever product like this. It's whisper quiet. There's a our, our partnership with Harman Card, so there's going to be a JBL or Harman Card or Infinity, which is the same family of surround sound speakers in it, plus a sub. Um, it'll either run, we don't know because it's a prototype, but it'll, it'll run Android or Roku because we have those beautiful systems. It'll be the coolest, fastest, neatest, easiest to game with all those things systems on Earth because it has to match the brilliance and the leading edge technology of three lasers since we're the only ones in the world to do that. So on the 50th birthday of Hisense this year, 2019, with over 17 million units sold last year, number four in the world, and as we grow in this great country, we're proud to show what every dream of every TV has ever been, to have the best viewing experience that you could ever have without any of the disadvantages. And honestly, when you look at everything out there, there's only one place you could do that, and one product. 
well, you can do it on the 70 inch, which is our 700, or on the 100 inch, but three lasers is the only way we've ever known to do, no one has ever had this. And it'll have a non-reflective, uh, ambient light rejecting screen so that the blacks are black, so that you don't get any light in your room. It's, I'm fascinated. I want one really bad. Can you give me a good price? Oh, I was gonna ask you that. <laughs> I, can, I can ask for you. So, um, so basically, since it's just a prototype, uh, does Hisense have a target time? They wanna get this out to the market to the people who really want it? Well, it's TBD, so we don't have any date yet, but if you remember, let's just say it's similar to, to the last time with the dual laser that won the best of show again last year. Um, th we were projecting then, bad pun, um, that we were gonna have it out toward the end of the year, hopefully Christmas season, and look at, and then we'd have it out all throughout 2018. It's exactly what happened. Yeah, so great hoping, TV. Yeah, yeah, we're hoping for the same thing. So that's, you know, and uh, um, it's just nice to know that we got something at a reasonable idea. We don't know the cost of this yet, but look at the, the dual laser, which is the only one of its kind like that with those two pure lasers in the, in the business. Um, priced at $10,000 for the uh, 100 inch and 13,000 roughly retail for the 120. Or, yeah, for the old, well, the current model, the, this current is the future model. one, right. And we're just hoping that, Hisense is always reasonably priced, so you never have to worry that it's gonna be higher than anybody else. Okay, well, thanks, Rick. Are you kidding? Great to see you, my friend. You Great too. Great to see all of you. Welcome to CES 2019. This guy does the best things in the world, so watch every one of his broadcasts. Well, I appreciate that. Thanks Great again, Rick. Thank you. See you soon.